Imagine an experiment where every result is correct, even when it shouldn't be. That's exactly what happened nearly a century ago. In 1924, a team of researchers walked into the Western Electric Plant in Hawthorne, Illinois. Their mission was simple. Find out if better lighting could make workers more productive. It seemed logical. Brighter lights, more work done. Dim the lights, productivity should drop. But what happened next left everyone scratching their heads. First, they cranked up the brightness, and productivity shot up. Great, just as they predicted. But then, they decided to dim the lights expecting the opposite. Instead, productivity went up again. Confused, they started changing other things. They adjusted break times, and production increased. They even returned everything to the way it was before they started. And somehow, production still went up. It seemed like no matter what they did, every single change led to better results. The researchers had accidentally discovered something far more profound. It wasn't the brightness of the bulbs that mattered. It was the fact that someone was paying attention. The workers knew they were being observed. For the first time, people were asking about their comfort, their environment, and their work. And that feeling of being seen, of being valued, made them want to try harder. This phenomenon became known as the Hawthorne Effect, the simple idea that human behavior changes when people know they re-being watched. But here's the twist that most people don't know. Decades later, when modern researchers re-examined the original study, they found some problems. The notes were messy and incomplete. The measurements were inconsistent. Some of the results even contradicted each other. The clean, simple story we all know had been simplified over time, maybe even a little exaggerated. And yet, the idea survived. Why? Because the core message is incredibly powerful. Because it just feels true. Because genuine attention really does change how people act, how they work, and how they feel about themselves. Today, you'll find the Hawthorne Effect mentioned in leadership books, HR training seminars, and even in how teachers manage their classrooms. So maybe the original science wasn't perfect, but the human insight it revealed was groundbreaking. It taught us that people don't just work for a paycheck. They work for a sense of meaning, for recognition, and for the feeling that what they do actually matters. It turns out the most important switch for boosting productivity isn't on the wall. It's in how we see and treat each other. Thanks for watching. If you found this interesting, don't forget to like and subscribe for more stories from the history of science.